What is up guys, Master Rolf here with another Clash of Clans episode for you, and today, as you can see, I have unlocked the balloon. So I've upgraded my barracks to level 6. I think I've got these two are level 6, this one's still a level 5. So um, we need to upgrade that one to upgrade, uh, be able to get them. But yeah, I have unlocked the balloons. Now they are level 1, and from the photo, they look pretty damn beast. And some people have actually commented saying, if you get balloons and level them up, they actually are really OP. And then some people are saying... They're not OP at all, so I'm kind of intrigued to see how they rock, how they roll, and how good they are. So this is going to be like one of my first time using the balloons. Uh, I put them out before, but I had no idea what I was doing with them. So let's go out and have a look. We also create a spell while we're here. Alright, so yeah, I need to um, research and upgrade some stuff. I actually want to upgrade my archers, uh, but obviously I don't have enough elixir. So maybe now, if we go out, we might get enough elixir. So I've literally only got... Uh, balloons, heavies, and do I? That's all. I think that's all I have. I must have a little bit, a few wall breakers in there, and a few goblins. So let's go in and attack. Our shield will be deactivated. All right. So we want to find someone with around 50k um, elixir. That's that's not too bad. That that could be that could be relatively easy. Um, I don't know whether I should give this one a go. <laughs> Should I give this one a go? Yeah, let's, let's give this one a little go. So, I'm going to go in here. I'm going to try and take out the mortar to start with. Um, oh, for fuck's sake. Take down my wall breaker. All right, there we go. All right, let's put them in. I'm not quite sure what I've been given. Oh, I've been given loads of giants. All right, that's all right. So, we've got some good heavy giants going in right now as well. Uh, I'm going to use my balloons, but I'm not going to use them because that's right there. Uh, so, I'm going to kind of hold out on them. I've got 12 of them to throw out, so I think that's quite a lot. Uh, so I'm just going to wait for now and see what happens. I'm going to send in a few of these guys to go and uh, just grab some of the loot while we're kind of trying to attack these over here. So as soon as they take out this air defense, which hopefully they'll do pretty soon, I will fly in my air balloon. I'm going to put one in to start with just to see what it does and uh, then move on from there. So hopefully they're going to destroy that slowly but surely. Put in a few more goblins. Right, so that's going to be destroyed. Or is it? Is that even not going to be destroyed? Uh, that, didn't, that didn't even get destroyed. Wow, seriously? Okay. I'm going to put those two in there. Uh, and then I'm going to send those two in. Go on, destroy that. And I want to throw these in. Come on, let me use them. I should know that thing there will absolutely... There we go, all right. So let's send in, send in some air balloons. So I think they drop bombs, I believe. Let's have a look. Yeah, there we go. They drop bombs and they do damage to quite a big radius. Uh, they can't be... Oh, they can be shot down by the archers. Okay. Uh, but the cannons didn't seem to be able to, to kill them. So that's worked out pretty well. So we've taken that lot down. I'm going to send in my other goblins just to finish that off. They can go now and um, I'll send them some more balloons over here. Let's see if that will do the damage. Wow, the archers actually take them out pretty quickly. I'm surprised how quickly they, they do damage on them. But they're pretty damaging to be fair, these balloons. So I'm, I'm actually quite impressed with how strong they are. I'm sending more in. Hopefully we can take these down. There should be enough of them to take them down. It's just that one archer that's been the problem. There we go. All right, take out that final archer. And we've only got a few goblins going to work, but they are taking everything. And now the balloons can go around and, and just take stuff out. So I'm actually going to, because we haven't got long left, I'm going to send a couple in there uh, to take out the big stuff and get the rest of the coins. I think that's, yeah, that's all where the coins are. Come on, guys, take out all the coins. You can do this. So they are pretty slow, uh, especially at like reloading. They seem to be pretty damn slow, uh, but they do good damage. I guess it's all really that is important here. But at least we've got a lot of coins from it. Uh, we've got quite a bit of elixir. All we need now is another 50,000 elixir uh, to get to the next one. So yeah, so the balloons are pretty good. Personally, they're not actually my favorite thing to use. I think, to be honest, other tactics are a little bit better. So I'm actually going to just throw that one in there, get rid of him. I don't know why I did that. That was probably a waste. There we go. So we've got pretty much all of the stuff. Come on, get some more. No, we didn't get all of it, but that's pretty good. Um, 35 and 30,000. So instead of spawn spawning up more balloons, okay, it is just spawning up loads of balloons. We're going to go back and get some goblins in here. Uh, get a load of them in. What else have we got going on? Uh, let's throw a load of archers in the mix. And what else should we throw in? We need a couple of wall breakers. 
and a couple of giants, um, and then a couple of barbarians. Why the hell not? Actually, no, I can't because that is going over the limit. All right, so let's fast forward these lot. There we go. So we've got enough now to go back out. Uh, let's just see how the clan is going. Before I forget, guys, preparation day is going to end in 13 minutes. So we're about to take on Russia. So we're taking on the whole of Russia. Um, and let's have a quick look at how their clan looks while we're here. Um, so pretty good. Not too bad. We might be able to... You know what? We might actually have quite a good attack on this. Sadly, I'm not involved in it again, obviously, because I'm the lowest level. But not too bad at all. Uh, we might have a go at it. Let's just take all this stuff up. I've also slowly been working on upgrading my bombs. So we've got level 2 bombs here. Uh, a level 3 bomb. And one that needs to be rearmed that's level 2 as well. So I'm upgrading these lots slowly. I'm actually going to upgrade this one right now. Take 2 hours. Not too bad. Because um, I think they'll, they'll do the most damage sat there and there. But yeah, I didn't actually know you could upgrade the bombs. So I was kind of interested when I figured that out. Anyway, let's go and attack somebody else. So let's see if we can get the 50,000 elixir we need. Uh, to actually destroy, destroy, actually upgrade our troops. Come on. I don't seem to get much that have loads of elixir or anything at the moment. I don't know why. Um, nope, nothing here again. Two thousand. Oh man, come on. We want something a little bit beefier. 13,000. You know what? We might actually be able to take a... I'm going to put just an archer down. Alright, let's. we're going to put down just literally like three... Alright, we can only put down two. So let's put down these archers. Now, it might take a minute, uh, but they will be able to take that slowly. So we're going to take a little bit of elixir from this guy. Um, I honestly, obviously don't ma ma uh, mind about my uh, trophies. So we just want to take a little bit of elixir from this. We should be able to get maybe like a thousand or two. We might get a couple of thousand actually from these two elixir things here. Hopefully these lot won't die. Okay. <laughs> yeah, they're getting killed. Uh, oh no, can't, can't see the other two. So that's alright. We're taking a little bit of elixir from this guy. So thank you for the little bit of help. But yeah, we want to upgrade our stuff. We want to upgrade like our um, archers. All the giants. Giants would be nice to upgrade. But I think I use the archers more than the giants, to be totally honest. Because the archers, the range of them is a serious, serious awesome thing to have. So there we go. We've basically taken his little bit of elixir that I can take without throwing loads of troops at it and without them dying. Can I? I'm just intrigued to see if I can hit them on that. Is he going to get it? Oh, no. They got killed. All right. So, we're going to surrender. That's fine. We've taken a little bit of loot from you. What do we take? 4,000. That's that's not too bad for, like, four people. Uh, so, let's go and attack again. Let's find someone with a little bit more loot. Um, again, I, I could always... Can I throw that guy in there and not be killed? Yeah, I can. All right. Let's throw three archers in there. Uh, and get that bit of loot. I'm going to throw that there. Oh. Uh, I'm going to take some coins. All right. So, that's just going to take a little bit of it. Once they die, they die. It's an alright tactic, this actually, going around and taking little bits from here and there. But it, it, it is kind of a slow tactic. Uh, but it does kind of work well, especially if you don't mind about your um, your trophy level. Uh, they're getting killed. They're getting killed. Alright, so we've taken a, a few coins and a bit of elixir. Let's see what these girls go for now. See if they can get us a couple more. There we go. Let's get a few more elixir. We're literally getting like 20 more. And she... She did. I, I tell you, she did. There we go. That's <laughs> it. Not even a thousand. I don't even know if that will cover the troops. I think it will actually. Yeah, it should do. All right, come on, give us, give us a nice. All right, this is what we're after, and that's actually an all right place uh, for it to be. So let's send in, let's send in the archers around the side, and send in some heavies, uh, and then take the rest just with archers. Should be okay. Where's their elixir storage? Oh, it is down there in the middle. So this should be re relatively quick. And I'm sending some goblins as well to, to kind of speed it up a little bit. But we're mainly going for elixir here, so I don't really mind about the gold. That being said, though, I'm just going to spread a few of these guys around. Like that. Just get a little bit of the gold. We should get a few thousand from that. So that, that might work out pretty well. I'm going to let this lot go in and do whatever damage they want to do. I'm not going to um, send those more in though. I'm just going to put a couple here to get the rest of this gold. They've actually taken a lot of gold up here, those, 
Those couple of goblins I put in have actually done an alright job. So let's take the rest of those gold coins. And that should do. Go on, get some of that one too, my friend. Yeah, there we go. We got a few coins. Alright, so we were able to get this uh, storage as well. So there's quite a lot coming from it. This is actually a surprising good amount. We've got 250,000, guys. We can upgrade them again. So we have got enough to upgrade our troops, which is always good. And that's kind of what we were after. Alright, so they're slowly being taken out by that sniper tower. But at least we're getting a few coins for it as well. Alright, so we'll surrender. End the battle. Oh, we won. Okay, we actually got trophies as well. <clears throat> that worked out quite well for us. So let's go and attack again. Give us another person like that with all their like storage outside. Um... Is that going to be doable? Is that alright? Or is that a little bit... I don't want to waste my guys. That's the thing. Um, I'm actually going to go to the next one. Hopefully there'll be a little bit easier one with all their storage kind of out in the open. Nope. Um, nope. Come on, we just want to get... <clears throat> oh, hello. Wow. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to take that one out. But it's always so tempting to have a go. But sometimes I look at it and I'm just like, no, there's no way I can take that. Alright, so we can definitely take some of this with our archers. Okay, they can actually see us from there. So I'm going to put these down here. We're going to send in a few of them and a few goblins. <coughs> Go on, goblins. Alright, so we'll be able to take quite a bit of it out. We can actually take some of the out back here, actually. Um, so let's, let's send in some goblins in here to take some of the coins. <laughs> Pretty good one. And those goblins are just chewing up. So we've taken all the elixir. I don't know how there's still a storage left, but we've taken all the elixir. Uh, and now we're just trying to take these. You know what? Let's spawn our guys in. Just get the rest of this. This one's nearly finished anyway, so um, we're going to spawn in all our people right now. Because the air defense is all the way over there, so... I don't know. The balloons might, might be alright. They've only got the one archer to worry about in the middle. But otherwise, we should be able to take them out. We've taken all of his loot... Even though he's got storage left, and I can see, I can clearly see two coins left. But apparently I can't get those coins. No, look at them taking down my balloons. No. You can do it, skeleton. Drop your bombs. Ah, oh, there we go. Game over, my friend. I'll surrender for that. Anyway, guys, so there we go. We can now go and upgrade our troop in our research facility. Booyah, there we go. That's what we wanted to upgrade. Archer, two days. That'll be pretty epic now to go up to level three. Thank you for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed this episode. I will see you hopefully tomorrow where the clan war will have started because it does start in five minutes. Um, and hopefully we'll be all right and I can report some battles back to you. So thanks for watching, guys. I will see you shortly. Thanks for watching everyone, if you enjoyed it please do hit the like button down below and also comment on whatever you want. Now, if you haven't seen it already, I'm starting to do GTA 5 videos, so make sure you hit on that thumbnail to be taken straight to the link for some GTA 5 antics. Thanks for watching guys, I will see you in the next video.